Right now at 4 o'clock, federal agents searched the president's beach house. The FBI was at Joe Biden's Rehoboth Beach property today as part of the ongoing probe into his handling of classified documents. This afternoon, we've learned that the search has ended with no classified documents found. It is Wednesday afternoon. I'm Sarah Bloomquist. And I'm Brian Taft. The big story on Action News today is the latest search of a property belonging to the president. We're told today's search was planned and the president continues cooperating with the DOJ investigation. Action News reporter Aliana Gomez is live now in Rehoboth Beach with more on what took place there today. Aliana. Brian and Sarah, good afternoon to you. As you mentioned, this was a planned search. President Biden and his attorney had a heads up about this, as well as the Secret Service who guards President Biden's beach home here in Rehoboth Beach. And this is just another step in this very thorough and ongoing process to continue to search for more classified documents. President Joe Biden's vacation home in Rehoboth Beach, Delaware, was at the center of an ongoing investigation today in the search for more classified documents. His personal attorney, Bob Bauer, says no classified documents were found at the president's beach house, saying, quote, consistent with the process in Wilmington, the DOJ took for further review some materials and handwritten notes that appear to relate to his time as vice president. All this after the DOJ uncovered documents at both his Wilmington home and the Penn Biden Center offices in D.C. We have cooperated fully. The president's personal attorneys have provided information to DOJ. White House counsel spokesperson Ian Sams on the defensive just one day after the president faced criticism for lack of transparency on that previous DOJ search of Biden's home and former office. If we have information to share about activities that have been conducted, we will do that. President Biden now follows both former President Donald Trump and Vice President Mike Pence with a discovery of classified documents at their private homes, which is a national security concern. I think the American public is coming to the conclusion that there isn't very much custody and control among any of these office holders as they leave office and and therein uh, lies the rub and that is where the solution has to be found. Political analyst Brian Sobel says it's a systemic problem that has now crossed party lines, one that needs to be addressed in a more meaningful way. There needs to be reform here where there is a, a system set up that provides custody of all these papers, even if the president has already left office. That three and a half hour search concluded about noon today, and there has been some word and some questions circulating about whether there will be any future searches of any more residents or offices belonging to President Biden. The White House did not reveal any information on that, but did say they will continue to be transparent with the public moving forward. Reporting live in Rehoboth Beach, Delaware, Aliana Gomez, Channel 6, Action News. Guys, we'll send it back to you. Okay, Aliana, thank you.